This is the car she wants. This one, we need to make sure it has, okay. So this deal is a little bit different. Okay, let's just call it this dealership. We're calling on a Toyota Camry. I know we're switching base off a little bit, guys. I promise you it's important. This dealership closes here soon, and I need them to give me this deal. Thank you for calling. Calls may be recorded for quality and training purposes. If you would like to schedule a service appointment or speak with someone in the service department, please press one. If you would like our sales department, please press two. For our parts department, please press three. If you would like to rent one of our Toyota vehicles, please press four. Wait, what's the number? For the accounting office, please it's press five. I, I wasn't For our finance to. department, please press six. For all other calls or to speak to a specific associate, please press zero for the operator. Two, two, two. two Thank two, you for two, calling two. Toyota. Two. Okay, perfect. Vehicle information and sales. This is Miranda. Hey, Miranda. Uh, you said you're in sales? Yes. Hey, awesome. I'm hoping you can help me out. I want to see if you guys have a car available on your lot. New or used? It's brand new. And who do I have a pleasure of speaking with? Uh, this is Tommy. Tommy. Gotcha. What's the vehicle? It is stock number 4710. Okay. Hold on one second. Camry LE? Yes, correct. So this one is here and available. Were you thinking about coming out and taking a look at it? Well, I'll let you know my dilemma here. So I, I thought I already had a car bought. I had a deal with uh, Toyota of Atlanta. Uh, and okay. uh, conveniently, uh, the lady in charge now really wants this macadamia interior. So now I have to find this macadamia interior. So I already have a deal. I like the deal. And worst case, I'm just going to tell her, no, she can't have the interior. But uh, I'm hoping you just match this deal call today and I can just buy your car instead. Okay. Um, what's the deal? It's 10% off MSRP, no add-ons. Okay. Well, we ha we are doing $47.59 under MSRP and it's going for $26,610. $26,610. Can you get that written down for me? I cannot. Okay. Okay. I won't be able to. Um, I mean, I can talk to my manager, but we don't. Typically, we don't um, send out all that type of stuff because we try to do everything while you're here. Um, mm -hmm. We we're we're just very uh, particular with how we do things. Um, okay. So now, what I can because we don't want to give you a number and then you go around and shop it around. Sure. Uh, we want you to get the number and then and really like the number and then and then buy the car. We don't want you to shop it around to all the competitors. You know, we don't want them to know all the discounts we're doing. <laughs> what makes us sell 600 cars a month yeah yeah no no, no I, I completely understand so like you know that's obviously a crazy discount uh yeah. we um can we do like is there any like add-ons fees anything along those nope. lines oh so the add-ons um are required fees our our dock fee uh registration fee and then sales tax okay. um so we have a 999 dock fee uh 229 registration fee and then your sales tax Okay, so you guys don't have like a protection package or anything along those lines? Nope, there's no packages on it. It's a full um, base model, LE, front wheel drive. Um, the key features on it are, you know, of course, your adaptive cruise control, Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, you know, just the normal stuff. But your LEs aren't going to come with um, with anything, you know, it's it's going to be more of your safety safety car rather than it's it's not going to have the sunroof. It's not going to have blind spot monitors. And if it does, that's because it comes with it comes with uh, it comes with that safety feature um it's not going to come with your your um it's going to come with a backup camera it's just not going to come with all the fancy dancy stuff okay so it doesn't have the blind spot doesn't have any of that um i'm trying to get a window sticker it may have the blind spots i haven't got to look at it so i'm not sure yeah, i was trying to look at a window sticker i don't think you guys have them on your website it should be on there because it's here on the lot so i should i should be able to see it hold on one where second. yeah where would i get more details no i'm trying to find the way this what you would do is uh if you're on your are you on your computer or phone yeah, I'm on my computer. computer yeah so when you go on it um and you type in the stock number it's gonna make sure you're under new vehicles you type in the stock number it'll pull it right up and you just click on it don't yeah. click any more details nothing like that just click on the picture it'll it'll open the whole thing up yeah. um so what it has the so for details it's got it's got bucket seats um, that's normal powered seats um, that's not normally normal but um, it probably came it's just probably one of the standard packages um, a lot of the 2024s are moving to power seats okay um, 
I don't see any any uh, crazy, you know, features or nothing like that. It, okay. Uh, okay. So you are saying you're at forty seven fifty nine off, no add ons, no fees, no anything else. Um, besides our doc fee, registration fee, and sales tax, then no, there's no other fees. Okay. Okay. Well, me. So I, yeah. What I can say is with. With just the dock fee and the registration fee, you're at twenty seven eight thirty eight. And normal and the MSRP for this car is thirty one three sixty nine. So yeah. you're still saving, you know, twelve grand. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, no, I understand that. It's more like I guess I, I guess I'm more confused if you guys have the discount, which I now see on the website, why you guys don't like put the it down in writing, you know, like it's on the website. What do you mean? Like you said you wouldn't put it down in writing. But like the discounts on. I wouldn't be able to send you a spec sheet or anything like that. I I, I don't have the power to do that, and I don't have a manager that's available to do that. Oh, I thought you said um, you don't want to shop at your price. We we're we're just very uh, particular with how we do things. Um, okay. So now what I can because we don't want to give you a number and then you go around and shop it around. Sure. Uh, we want you to get the number and then and really like the number and then and then buy the car. We don't want you to shop it around to all the competitors. You know we don't want them to know all the discounts we're doing. Yeah, no, I, and honestly, we don't we don't send out buyer's guides. We don't send out any of that type of stuff. It's typically something that we would put together when you're here. So, like, if you want a buyer's guide for your bank, we would typically put it together while you're here. We would hold the car while you go to the bank and get the, and get the check. Because if you don't like the car and you already got the check, then you're going to have to redo everything and start from square one. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, it just seems like a pretty crazy discount, obviously. So you could wonder why people. Yeah, yeah, and I mean, we we always have crazy discounts, and this one is actually one of the craziest that I've seen because I actually haven't seen one um, this high in a minute. Okay, um, and then uh, okay, so I'm just trying to, and then what's the is the interest rate two point nine nine percent on these as well right now? The all of them, I don't know what the interest rates are. They change month to month. Uh, it's kind of a oh. finance question. Um, so I do know that if you have a top tier credit, which is seven, I think seven hundred and higher, you're going to get a top tier rate. Is what that's pretty much whatever we're um, advertising usually. Um, and again, that depends on the bank as well, depending on what okay. the bank is advertising um, yeah. versus us, and then see where we can meet. Yeah, I was just looking at the giant spring to savings on your website. Like it's like super big, and it says two point nine nine percent. Yeah, yeah, and a lot of those are. Um, a lot of those are kind of um, they put sometimes that they put zero point nine nine. That's just a market interest. It's not really a, a, the actual interest rate. So you, know, you got to be careful with some of the advertisements because it would it would sometimes it's a market ad, um, oh. advertisement. So it'll it'll actually say what it is and it's uh, it would actually be like close to six percent or seven percent if they if they do it. Like it, you just have to move the decimal basically. Oh, okay. <laughs> so they advertise uh, one price so, and they change it. Yeah, so um, this one, um, we may be able to get you there. We would just have to see everything in person and do everything. We're, we're here for a local market. So all our policies are put, are put in place for the metro area. We're not able to do anything over the phone or remote or anything like that. Everything would be done in person. Okay. So it, do you have some time between tomorrow and Saturday to come out and take a look? We're here until Saturday. Possib possibly. Uh, like I said, we're looking at our calendar here. We're looking to buy by this weekend. Uh, it, it's just more, you know, as a consumer, you could probably understand why it's a little concerning that you won't give numbers that are on your website on a sheet, like you won't write it out. That's like, couldn't I just show this? I can to talk you? to my manager, yeah. but I, I'm promise you, I promise you I'll try. I can talk to my manager for you. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I, you, I see before the discount wasn't on there. Now it's on there. Like it's bright as day. Like It's been on there. Yeah, yeah mm -hmm. it's been on there. I, I just clicked on it. Okay. It yeah. was on there, yeah. um, but I can I can talk to my manager and see if he can get something written out for you or if he can talk to you. Sure. Yeah, it'd be great. All right. One second. All right. Bye. I will say that's super sketch. I've like gotten crazy deals on Camrys like this before. Sure, if they're about to hit a volume bonus. So sometimes dealerships will do this to hit a volume bonus. I've seen this before. I've gotten this big of a discount on a Camry before on a base model. That's super interesting. Um, you need to be super careful. Like for example, we see that the interest rate changing, they advertise 2.99 right there. Now they're saying it might be six or 7%. The Camry has low APR on this car. So that's like one thing to know. 
my client wants low APR, so they might not allow this deal unless we sign up at a 7% interest rate, which my client cares about the financing on this deal. So it doesn't add up. We will lose more if they mark the rate up two points or seven, eight, nine percent. We couldn't refinance that's down to that low APR anymore. So we wanna ask all these questions. We wanna make sure that uh, we're not getting uh, boozled, bamboozled. Uh, I have them on mute, just so you know. I don't know if she's gonna call back. I'm gonna send you to my manager right now. No problem, okay. Hello, is David. Hey David, how's it going? Good, good, uh, how can I help, sir? Hey, hey, I just got transferred to you. I was just looking at this car you guys have in your lot, and then, you know, it looks like you have pricing online. I was just asking for like an out-the-door breakdown, like, so I could look at it. Um, you know, a lot of dealerships do this like bait and switch stuff, and you have your prices on your website, you wanna tell me, I just don't know why you guys wouldn't give it in writing, and I got transferred to you. Yeah, so that, that, that's just just a policy that the company has, but if, if you actually look on, on our website, the breakdown, all it's going to be is going to be your state tax. Which, are you registering in the state of Georgia or, oh, are you, yeah, or yeah. where are you registering the vehicle? Yeah, 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 in Georgia, yeah. So, so if you're in the state of Georgia, just 7%, and then you have a 99 doc fee, and then 229 filing fee, and that's the only three fees you get, get on that. That's it. Okay, so nothing else. Um, I mean, do I have to finance at like 9% with this deal? Can I do a little APR on this deal? Correct. So all the pricing you see online is going to be in lieu of a special financing. So whatever special financing that you qualify for is what you'll be receiving. So it just depends all on the credit and everything else, of course. So you're saying if 2.99 is available, I can get 2.99? That's correct. Okay, and you can't put any of that in writing. I just have to trust you. Well, like I said, just keep in mind, I mean, we do this all the time. I mean, it's if the 2.99 is available for you, as long as you qualify, as long as you're 720 and above, and you qualify for 36 months, then you receive the 2.99. The only way you won't receive 2.99 is if your credit isn't up to par with what the Toyota specials are. Okay. And do you know if that's 2.99? Uh, yep. I'm looking at it right now as we speak. Okay. So it's 2.99 is available on that car. I can buy it for 26, 610, uh, and I'm not going to pay any other fees other than the fees you just mentioned. That, that's correct. So you're going to be paying your dock fee, which is nine ninety nine. You're paying your two twenty nine for your edge line filing fee, and then seven percent of your state tax. Okay. Because that's the registered in the state of Georgia. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, let me talk it over with the lady. Um, you know, obviously she likes to have everything written out so she can break it all down. So I will check with her to see if she's good with that. Um, she's she's pretty like she doesn't like to deal with dealerships, so she has me calling around. Um, so here I am doing that, and I will see if she wants to do that or not. Okay, no, I can play understand. I can play understand. Just let me know what uh, what you guys decide, and if there's something I can do, please let me know. And like I said, Miss Brando will be for whatever you guys need. All right. Okay, sounds good. All right, thank you, sir. All right, bye. Hmm. It does say that it has the rebate. Okay. So here's. Okay. Let's just. Okay. This is where my in lieu of special financing with approved credit are in lieu, okay. In lieu means like beside, like not, right? What is in lieu? In lieu just means, yeah, okay. So that's, so guys, this is why, yep, yeah, this is, and I just wanted to verify that. I know it's a stupid question. You guys can all be stupid in the chat, but this is why, oh, I'm so hungry all of a sudden. So right here, and he said it, and he said it too. And he said it too, and it's how he worded things out. He worded things very carefully. He said, as long as you qualify for the rate, you'll get the rate. Um, and then he did say in lieu of special financing, he made sure we mentioned that. Correct, so all the pricing you see online is gonna be in lieu of a special financing. So whatever special financing that you qualify for is what you'll be receiving. And it says right here, disclaimer, new car pricing includes all offers and incentives. So that price means that it includes every rebate. Like this rebate right here, college grad includes that and is in lieu of special financing with approved credit. May not be combined with other offers. Any advertised price is subject to change and may not include installed options. Um, that's, we have to have 720, which is fine. Um, it's definitely a trick on them. So like, and realistically, let's just be real, $4,700 off on a $3,100 car would be saying, 4759 or 31, 36, would be a 15% discount, which would be an insane discount. Now I've gotten these kind of discounts before. Um, but that's a lot of red flags. Okay, so let's talk about why this is red flags. So first off, anytime somebody's just offering you right out of the gate a 15% discount, don't, if anything is a, my philosophy is anything's too good to be true, it's probably too good to be true, but let's break it down. First off, 
So, do you essentially save people money by making better negotiations than I could? Yes, I also save them time, energy, and anxiety. Um, so, let's talk about like the red flags in this deal. Why do I not think, for again, so repeating. If a deal ever seems too good to be true, it almost always is. And you always want to do your due diligence if anything like that seems too good to be true, check it out. So first off, what were the red flags? She, they will not put this down in writing. Like, if you guys can't see this on YouTube, they have this pricing on their website. Karen, my link is in my bio. They have this pricing on the website. So if you're like, Tommy, our website, like we don't write this down, why couldn't I just share this link to another dealership, right? It's, the, it's on the website. Um, why are they so afraid to show their price and they're worried other people are gonna shop them if I could just show, hey, this dealership's offering 4,700. So that's step one. They should be able to give pricing on writing, but they won't give it on writing at all. Second, 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 second red flag is he said that I'd get the same deal and he did say it in lieu of special financing, I would get the deal. So I'd have to sign up at a crazy interest rate, like seven, eight, nine percent. That's no bueno. That's no good.